usual wolf and went into Mario. And when he was talking about when he was fighting against Isam, he said he was doing really well with the Mario, and he probably should have done it earlier. And now he's using uh, the Mario versus the Pikachu now, because he, re he realizes that he likes this matchup a bit more. Aloha just finding his way through it this early game. Oh, missing out on that spike. And nearly putting Charlie in a very predictable, uh, in an awkward predicament. This is not a good spot for uh, Aloha, though. Regrabbing the ledge. Up till, uh, down tilt to forward tilt. Just get him off stage. That bear, very safe on shield. Charlie hitting him with the up air into the up beat. Not going to kill the doesn't have enough percent on uh, Pikachu right now. Aloha throwing him off stage. This is what he wants. Oh, he couldn't get him with the last of, the, of that bear. Forward throw and to fair. Not going to kill just yet. Oh, that dare will trade with the up B and take him out, though. Good stuff coming in from Aloha. He's using all of his options to kind of space out Charlie and not let him in. Actually... Doing a great job of kind of suffocating Charlie. Not letting Charlie have the time to think. That forward smash, really smart coming in from Charlie, but a little late on the trigger. <coughs> Charlie trying to get him with the up B, but missing out just barely. Oh, up B into the, into the Thunder Jolt so uh, he could recover a little bit better. But taking a bit of damage and Juchan and um, Aloha will take every every form of extra credit that he, that he can. Down tilt to bear, not gonna kill just yet. <laughs> now this damage is coming through and Charlie's still having a hard time closing out these stocks. Aloha kinda running all over him. Interesting option with the quick attack. Hopefully, he was probably hoping that Charlie would um, <coughs> tech away. So I could follow up and then hit him with um, probably a cancel into like an, a, a a fair or something. But there's the bear, kind of kind of weak di coming in from Aloha, getting two frame with the forward tilt, but he's fine. CDK getting him with the back throw. That's gonna gonna be the stock for sure. <laughs> and it's uh. Still looking very, very much in Aloha's favor. But Charlie can definitely react and find his way in. Oh, nice spot dodge coming in from uh, Charlie. Very even game. Couldn't get him with that up air. And now both players spot dodging each other out, just not letting each other in. There's the down smash, not gonna kill Charlie just yet. Charlie trying to SDI his, his way out of there. There's an up air in, double up air into bear, getting him off stage. Looking very good, and there's the dash attack. That's gonna be the stock. Looking very much in Aloha's favor still. Let's see if Aloha can keep this lead going. Down throw into bear, not gonna connect. Trying to two frame with a forward smash. A little late on the trigger. Back, back throw, Aloha off stage. Aloha still finding issues. I mean, um, oh wow, that was just a very unsafe back air. Aloha wasn't finding issues at all. He was just, kinda just got caught out a little bit. Into an up air, not gonna, not going for anything risky, he just wants to go with the simple and clean combo. Missing out on that dash attack. Into a bear. Man, Charlie putting in work. And bringing it right back, bringing it right back to even. Aloha still can definitely close out this game though. Hanging with up bears, still juggling. Yep, both players still pretty close. Hitting him with, hitting it the cape, uh, caping away the thunder jolt. But now Charlie finding, finding his foot in the neutral. 
Finding out what he's punish what he can punish for Mario and what he can't. Up air into up B? Is that it? No, good DI coming in from Aloha. Back throw. Charlie's off stage. Aloha going for the bear. Forward smash training with an air. Sliding forward till coming in from Charlie. And now Charlie's trying to find this kill with the up smash. And he finally takes it right there. Game one going to Charlie after Aloha had a very convincing lead toward the beginning, like throughout most of that match. Game number two, Aloha opting to go to town and city. He did counter pick to this stage against Juchan, but no, instead he's going to Smashville. I wonder what stage is uh, Charlie banned against Futron. Hey, against uh, Aloha. So we're now at game number two on Smashville. Interesting stage. A lot less room for uh, both players to kind of play at. Not going to be able to connect with anything there. Ooh, up throw into fair. That was an interesting, uh, interesting option coming in from Charlie. But now he's off stage without a jump. Not gonna get um, trumped, however. Back throw coming in from Aloha. Oh, there's the dare, but put Charlie in a tech situation. Juchan and uh, Aloha following right up. There's the drag down there into up smash Aloha. That was a clean first stock yet again. Or a pretty clean first stock. Oh man, still getting him off stage. Caught his jump, but Charlie barely making it back on the stage. No up airs coming in. Up tilt, up air. Ooh, not gonna get that dare though. There's a bear coming in from Charlie and couldn't get on a two-frame with the forward smash. Aloha spacing him out. Doesn't want to really do anything too committal, but that forward tilt was too committal. <laughs> and Charlie punishing it with an up smash. But once again, Aloha with this very high extra credit with a 73% lead. Hitting with the forward smash. In the neutral. Back throw. Let's see what the Aloha can do. Not gonna be able to capitalize on that off stage. There's the drag down there into up smash. Aloha hitting that conversion very consistently. Oh, but these up air strings gonna put in a lot of work. Oh, nice air dodge back on the stage coming up from Aloha. Dash. And you only got one of the quick attacks. Not going to be able to be able to uh, follow up much on it. And that was a uh, very that was an interesting di coming in from Charlie. Drop down there into the grab, but Aloha getting this extra credit still. Nice tomahawk grab coming in from Charlie. But Aloha punishing that up, that very risky up smash. Charlie still needs to find a, a kind of high committal option so he could close out these stocks. Nice grab. Oh, uh, trying to wait out what Aloha was going to do. Getting him with the two frame on the down tilt. Hopefully, he was hoping that he was going to go for a jump get up. Probably. There's an up smash though. That's going to take out the stock. Oh, that... I don't know why that bear crossed up so hard. <laughs> that was the hardest cross up in 2019. <laughs> Down tilt's coming in. And we're right at an even game yet again. Same situation that happened in the last game. Oh, and there's a forward smash? Not gonna kill. Late hit of up air. 
Aloha not realizing that he got that hitbox. Down smash. Charlie not being able to do too much about that. Drop down there. Oh, he definitely had a jab lock opportunity, but didn't capitalize on it. There's the bear. That's going to be it. Charlie taking this one. Oh, the semis. My bad. All right. So we're now at game number three. Charlie was having such a hard time near these er uh, for these early games. Oh, got him with the cape. Earliest stock taken so far is nice zero to death coming in from CDK. That was a quick stock too, like 15 seconds. Like before 15 seconds actually. What's he gonna do? Oh, he definitely could have closed out. Um, Aloha put himself in a really risky situation right there. Oh, and an SD coming in from Aloha. Not what you wanna see happen. There's a forward smash coming in from him. Oh, up air. That down smash, very unsafe. Going in for an up throw, bear. Just doing a quick 39. Ooh, I wonder if Charlie could have gone for a fair after that up air. It's not really true, but it's sometimes, sometimes it's just the right option. And there's a forward smash. Wow, that was the fastest game all so far. Just a quick one minute. Five seconds, something like that. A 65 second game, something around there. Good stuff coming in from Charlie.